<sighs> Hello everybody and welcome to Are You Smarter Than a 5th Grader? Which is for me to find out, am I smarter than a 5th grader still? The answer, probably not. But I'm gonna find out now. I was doing pretty good earlier. Let's see if I can do good now. And it's on the Wii 2008, so yeah, it's old. I mean, it's been like three years since the last time I was in school, but fifth grade is a long time. What are you gonna do? Yeah, you get the point. We picked the student and all that. First grade? Full. Full second grade? Full third grade? Full fourth grade, and then both fifth grade, the last two. Alright, me versus Paul for fifth grade health. Sir Alexander Felmy discovered the antibiotic properties of mold of a mold that lead to what medicine? Hydro. Honestly, I don't know. Oh come on! First grade art science. Or no, science. That. Which season falls spring? Oh. Wow, I was sure about that. Wait, I didn't get to hear if I was right or not. Anyway. And the correct answer is. Oh, I was right the last. I'm sorry, but you have flunked out of school. Oh no, I can't believe it. Okay, it's time to pick which fifth grade. Let's have uh, one more. Right, the fourth grade now. Here's the Wait, what? Two plus seven equals seven plus two is an example of which property of addition? Commutative identity distributive or substance. No, I'm sorry. I don't like it when it's word math. I don't oh, know it. No. Maybe one that's fine. Your classmate must have been absent that day. I'm sorry, but you have to. Oh, it's time to decide which one of these young scholars you would need to choose Justin. <laughs> One that was an even number, I chose 15 out as well. Okay, it's time to check out your classmates' answers. Sometimes even fifth graders get some wrong. It's 
Just call for second grade measurements. On what scale is water freeze at zero? Celsius. I believe. Second grade art, just to finish off the bar. A pain that looks like three dimensional would be an example of one element of art. I chose lines. First grade English. Okay, you're playing for $5, How many verbs can you find in this sentence? Did you see the look in jo Joey's eyes? Your classmate is locked in. Two. That is correct. Two. Yeah. Yeah. Two. Yeah. Yeah. That is not correct. Only have one. No. There's your answer highlighted up there. Show us the correct answer. First grade math. Okay. $1, Which number is less than 15? 14. Yes. You probably just picked the first answer you saw, but luckily it was the right one. Excellent. Pick another subject. Yeah, first grade grammar, why okay. not? Oh no! A question X email mark of period come to the end of the sentence. I just think it's true or false. Is in already. Oh, that's true. I feel good about this. Right. You got $2, yeah, because that was a period yes. end of the sentence, so I'm not you right that time. Paul, now Tara. Second grade world geography. Okay. The five thousand dollar question is How many degrees of latitude are there on a globe? Uh, three sixty. That's not Oh come on. Oh man, that's just incredible. It was ninety arch or one yeah, one eighty. Not really. Got five thousand dollars. Thankfully, let's pick a subject. Okay, great English. Okay. Ten thousand dollar question is: How many constants are there in the world's simon? Going for fifth grade math. Okay, you're playing for one thousand dollars on this first question. 
Uh, true or false, 67 is a prime number. And my phone is recording, so there's no way my phone, you know, I'm using my phone, so. Yep. I'm going with true. I'm going with true. You got that one right. Oh, thank God. Yes. To finish it off, we'll just pick fifth grade help. Okay, the two thousand dollar question is true or false again. A reflex action is a momentum our body does automatically. False. That's not the right answer. Mm. You're kidding. It was true twice. Damn it. Never underestimate the power of fifth grade. You got ten thousand dollars. Your class, you have to say fifty. I'm going to. You got your classmate up here with you. Pick a subject. Third grade music with Paul. Okay. What same scales is the key of C? What notes is L A? Okay. It shows A. That's it. That's the right answer. Woo! All right. Which subject do you want? Fourth grade art. Okay. A ten thousand dollar question is. Oh, come on. True or false? Yellow. Dash red is an example of what? Wait, one intimate color. Wait, that doesn't make sense. True, because it's like orange, I guess. That's not false. Freaking Christ. Oh, man. Let's see, true or false questions. Now let's see. Right. It's false. Uh, it's funny to me. What's up? Fourth grade math again. Okay. Here's the question. If an angle measures 90 degrees, what kind of angle is it? Melissa locked in her answer very quickly. Above a tooth? Yeah, it. No. Oh, it's probably ah. cute. Uh. I wonder if your partner can get you out of this one. Probably. Sometimes even a fifth grader can't save you. It's now the I I'm going to Second grade English. Okay. A $1, question is, How many vowels in the word dry? Three. I picked one. You got that one right. Well, it's a, it's a three letter word. Why would there not be one this one vowel? Which subject do you want? First grade how? Okay. The two thousand dollar question is What is called the most important meal of the day because it gives you oh that's breakfast. You got two thousand dollars. Yes. Your classmates can only help you two questions at a time. I'm going to let's pick a subject. Alright, Justin with first grade world geography. In order of land size, which continent is the second smallest? Europe, North, South, or Asia? It's obviously Asia, I think. No, it was, I think it was Europe. Shit. It was Europe, because the other ones are pretty big, too. Even though that was my second guess.
Uh, is this a second grade grammar or free Let's go vocabulary. I haven't seen that one yet. Major and minor are what kind of words? Cinnamons, abdomens, minors, I think. I, or onomata. What the fuck? Let's go, Simon. Or Simon Tower. Sorry, but that is not the right answer. Yay. I want to see anyway. Oh, Ah, I need that funk out. It's not very sorry. It's time to decide which one of these young scholars. What's that again? All right. First grade art. Okay. One thousand dollars. Here's the question. What do we call something you paint on that is made from a pelly woven fabric, wall, clay pot, chalkboard, Lisa, or canvas? Probably chalkboard. Good question. Sorry, but that is not the right answer. Uh, I think of it. Oh, man. Only your partner can help you now. They won't be able to save you everything. Now, the idea. Oh. I'm trying to love this. There's not a single math question. Fifth grade life science. Okay. For $1,000, here's the question. What do we call different specialist subunits within a cell? Paul has locked in his answer. I'm going to go psycho. Yeah, cytoplasma. Oh, yeah, I know. No. Ah. No. That word. Let's see if your partner can handle this one. They won't be able to say. I knew it was the M word. It's time to. Oh, there we go. Burgery math. Okay. For $1,000, here's the question. Craig buys and sells rare comics. He bought one comic for $9.25 and sold it for $21. How much profit did he make? No, I'm not. Oh, okay, four fifty. You got one thousand dollars. Yes. Let's pick a subject. For a great animal science, just to get that far okay. done. You're playing for two thousand dollars. And what habitat what can you find a GNU? What the hell does that even mean? Grasslands, tundra, ocean, or the forest. Your classmate is now locked. In. I don't know, I guess the tundra. Good thing the first time your instincts have been uh. astray is. Oh. oh man, that's just incredible. Let's see if your classmate does this stuff any better than you do. These fifth graders really know their stuff. Yeah, because they're still in the fifth grade. You've got two thousand dollars. I've been in the fifth grade in like ten, eleven years. Yeah, at least your classmate didn't sleep through the fifth grade. Yeah, you're okay, thank you. Alright, let's go. We're going back to second grade health. Okay. For five thousand dollars. Here is the question. Oh carrots are a good for hearing. Oh, that's false. Everyone says they're good for seeing. You got that one right. Yes. For some reason, too. You got your classmate up here with you. Pick a subject. Fifth grade art. Okay, the $10,000 question is... What do we call two colors that produce gray when combined? 
Black and white. Oh wait, oh, wait, oh no, it's probably the name thing. What's the correct answer? How was I gonna know that? That's all. He's on a roll there too, I think. It's, it's time to decide which one of these young scholars is going to sink in. Alright, let's find out. Are you smarter than Fergray Mask? Yes. Okay. That was so good, man. Thank you. The supplement of the right angle is a. Oh, wait, what? Wait, it's the supplement of a right angle is what? So it's a. Oh, this is a tricky one. Obtuse? No. Uh, if it was right angle, I'm gonna scream. Wow, I was sure about that. Let's see if your partner knows what the answer is. Okay, I'm just done. That question was literally giving you the answer right there. I, I don't know why I was doing that. First grade music. Okay, the following which is not a keyboard instrument. Guitar? You got that one right. Hey, dogs. Should have gotten the second. Should have got both of them right. I don't need it. Who did I talk to? Justin. First? No, for a great physical science, we could finish. Okay. Yeah, I didn't know. Right. What do we call matter that can be burned to produce energy? Gas, right? One clock in my hand. No, sorry. Ah. Uh. What's the correct answer? I need to read it too, right? It's time. I'm uh. Let's see. The list. All right, let's find out. Are you smarter than a fifth grade? No, so I'm going with fourth grade measurements. Okay. Something that occurs twice a year or once every year. Two years is called what? Paul has locked in his answer. Samuel, Daniel, uh, all the yearly? No. That is not correct. It was multi yearly. Christ, failure. No. You out of this one. You can always count on fifth. Oh, I was wrong, but I didn't even heard of that year thing. Yeah, he does great. Thank you. Finish off the bar, fourth grade world geography. Okay, you're playing for two thousand dollars. What is the largest city in France? Oh, Hopefully it's Paris. You got two thousand dollars. Oh my god, nine million? It's time to decide. Tara, what's up? First grade science, let's go. Here is the question. Which of the following foods has seeds inside? Wait, no, oh, what? Carrots? I think it's carrot seeds. I don't think I've ever heard of anything else having seeds. No. What? Oh man, that's just incredible. Right, well, there you are. And the correct answer is. Oh, I was right to begin with. It was squash. Let's go, Jed. And then Justin. Lucky. Right. First grade math. Let's go. If you were to divide nine 
candidates between three, how many pieces would each children get? Three. Yeah, I do. Three times three is nine. Invent oh fourth grade inventors. I've never heard of that until Oh, it's do spelling. Yeah, first grade spelling actually. Your play for two thousand dollars. True or false, the word elementary starts and ends with cotton. is locked in for this response. <laughs> Oh, it's false. Oh, damn it. Oh, wait, no, my, my student can see me, right? I wonder if your partner can get you out of this one. Alright, so embarrassing now. There are some questions even. Oh, come on, we both can't. What, where do we go? The same school? Pick a classmate and let's get started. Alright. Oh, wait, didn't he? Yeah, I just took good points. What's, what's one? And what are your favorite subjects? Oh. Uh, Which of the following is not considered an art movement? I just picked first grade art. So. Experiment. This is fingerprints. No. You can always count on fifth it was fingerprints. I should have known. Yes, yes. Thank you. I was thinking too. You got one thousand dollars. I read the question wrong. Pick another subject. First grade animal science. True or false, Komodo dragons are extinct. Wait. Your classmate is locked in already. Oh, wait. Yeah, that's a false, right? You've got two thousand dollars. Oh, so close to failing that. It's time to decide. Oh, let's go. What did I even okay. choose? Four? How many states four like Michigan is? Oh, it is four. Oh, holy crap. I have 5,000 now. Second grade astronomy to finish off those two below dollars. The orbital period of Halley's Comet is about 75 years. Oh, it was true. Fucking sorry. Wow, I was sure about that. I failed. And the correct answer. He already helped me once. He only really helped me once. It's time to pick which fifth grade you and me, Justin. Let's see the list. All right, let's find out. Are you smarter than a fifth grader? Right, go back to the spelling. That's okay. third grade. Come on, I'm going with 10. No, I'm sorry. It's probably 9. No! Oh, man. Let's see if your classmate does this stuff any better than you do. 
Hope so. And the fifth graders have. It was 11? Jesus. Thanks, Justin. Mercury is strong when you finish off this guy. Asteroids orbit the sun in what direction? Clockwise, circular, parallel, or counterclockwise? I'll go with parallel, if I'm coming off. Well right I am wrong. Yeah, I don't even care what the right answer is. Alright, it's the last round. No matter what. Let's go, Paul. Bird gray math. It's all on the line now. What is the next number in the pattern? 1140. 12. 1220. 1240. You must have learned something in school because that's the right answer. Ooh. It's another subject. To finish it off. Third grade earth science in the third grade. Yeah, we finish out the third grade, not the whole thing. El Naya is Weber phenomenon in what ocean? India? Oh, it's too late. Stop doing the piece, please. You've got two thousand dollars. Looks like you'll be sticking around. It's time to call a new teacher. All right, let's go. Fourth grade English. Okay. The five thousand dollar question is. <laughs> Peter Jezza is. Better known by Seuss what name? Well, it's not Seuss. It's Mark Twain? I don't know. That's not the right answer. Yeah, let's see what the right answer is because I don't even know it. I know it's not no. Seuss. Show us the correct answer, please. It is? What? That was Dr. Seuss's name? I'm sorry. It's been a flunked out of school. Sure did funk out of school. See you guys on the next one. Peace. <sighs> Hope you enjoyed it. Just remember stuff from the fifth grade next time.